Hello and welcome back to Caves of Cud. Um, let me see what we got left here. We've got some get killeds and some various difficult tasks. Um, and we also have to, let's see if we can't find a clone link. That wouldn't be a bad thing. If we could find a clone link, um, then we could maybe try and get 30 clones of ourselves. The only place I know of that like is guaranteed to have a cloneling is the is Bethesda Susan, but I'm pretty sure I killed all of them. Okay, we have a, a legendary arachnid here. Dislike by trolls. It'd be nice to get back on uh, back on good terms with trolls. Sure, let's uh let's take out this guy. Oh, there's a uh, space-time vortex. Jesus, okay. It's gonna be like that, is it? Where'd they go? There they are. Hmm. Why are we not using our fist? Okay, we are using the fist, but we're not penetrating this thing, really? Okay. That was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Glow whites are now, like, favored. We're back to zero with trolls. Fragment's not cool with us. That's fine. Muppeter. Um, all right. Where, where was I going? Couldn't even tell you. We were gonna go to Bethesda Sousa. Don't get lost again, please. Oh my God. God's sakes. Why did we have to lose all of our skills? <laughs> This has been a skillless run for, like, close to 10 episodes now. Is that not a little bit absurd? Do I get any... Do, yo, do I get any YouTube rep for that? What do you think? Probably not. I think that does say that skills are not as meaningful as maybe attributes. Because at the end of the day, strength is strength. Like, using a second gun is for sure going to make the difference, but also just having an absurd amount of strength. Oh, we don't even have that much strength. Oh, okay, never mind. 38 strength, we're, we're pretty up there. So, I mean, I think there's a good, like, five achievements that are based on dying. Uh, you know, easy stuff. Um... Just having a quick look here. Again. We have to collect a lot of artifacts. A lot of the artifacts are going to be very luck based. We got to find uh, something worth 200 reputation that we can throw into the technology hole. Uh, we have to f discover or visit 100 generated villages. We have to invent 40 recipes. If I could find learn cooking and gathering again, then that would be great. But... Um, yeah, that's that's for the next run. Honestly, like trying to get the most trying to squeeze this run for all of its value is probably punishing me because we're we're not able to get quite a lot of achievements on this run now. Like they're just locked out to us forever. Just like by goat folk, loved by pariahs. I'll just leave that guy alone. <sighs> Heading to Bethesda, uh, Bethesda Susa. Getting harassed by dragonflies. Too famished. Can't cook. Hostiles nearby. Okay, leaving. I I really oh my god, stop getting lost, please. Please uh oh whoops. 
highly entropic beings love us now roots are also a little bit nicer to us um incredible this was quite the place yeah i should go to more snapjaw forts they seem to have like if there's a legendary um and i don't think that legendaries are, are guaranteed but um you know if if there's a legendary you can you can make some nice uh, early game reputation i'm really getting sick of the, the mountains i gotta say there's all kinds of goons that just don't matter at all dragonflies and pigs and all kinds of jerks and they all hate us and i don't care and they're just so pathetic like pathetically weak they just don't matter at all they're not a threat to us there's some barathromites here it's gonna hold down the melee button tired of it okay leaving please no, I don't want to visit some ruins. I don't... You're going to get lost like seven more times? I hate the canyons. Truly hate the canyons. We'll always hate the canyons. We'll always hate the canyons. Nothing will ever redeem the canyons for me. What do you mean there are hostiles nearby? No, there are not. Stop lying. Okay, flower fields. We're in the jungle, thank God. So I'm pretty sure I already killed all of the... Um, are we on bad turns with slimes? One error while loading the zone. You can check your player.log or examine the corrupted objects for errors. Once finished, you can wish for clear corrupt to remove the offending uh, objects and continue playing. Uh, what is this going to look like? Oh, okay. There's a little little bit of corruption. A little bit of corruption as a treat. Okay. Um. Do a quick explore. I I really like don't know what I hope to achieve here. I'm just kind of hoping beyond hope that there's a cloneling that I I have somehow missed. Would be nice. I don't think it's gonna happen. There's a sparking beetle. Three items of serene visage. I never did acquire that, did I? That was too tall an, an order for me. Six crystal long swords. Yep. Sorry, beetle was never going to happen really Got some phase spiders rhinox you kill the rhinox So this is this is it, huh? There's like nothing nothing going on here. No clonelings. Okay, um Damn. I really just need a little bit more clone cloning draught. I guess if I was gonna do it with um temporal clones and self clones then I would need uh, 21 cloning draws. That's really not a big ask. It would really be nice if I didn't have to do that, but uh, that's not happening. So we can check our Iker Merchant again. We're not really, I don't, I, 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 this is like the third or fourth time I have to count the number of cloning draws I have, but I'm pretty sure I have 13. Oh man, this is, this has been a really grindy achievement. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So I would need seven, eight, eight more cloning draughts. Eight more. That's not too bad. 
but the problem is that like did you really just like there's nothing else for me to do there's not much else. there's nothing else going on right it's just ruin dining diving which is fine i like ruin diving but like uh i don't like this character anymore <laughs> like the character I, I, has got me kind of burnt out i gotta say um you know they they're bugged they don't have any skills there's not much interesting about them um so it's just kind of a problem if these guys had eight cloning drops right now, I would murder them for that. They don't even have one. No, no, not one there. Brain Brian there. At least we know that they have re uh, recovered their stuff. Brain Brian. All right, one, one cloning drop. No cloning drops, huh? Damn. Damn. Jeez. Oh, God. What do we do? Just what do we do? I guess we do some ruin diving. Like, I could go to the Baroque ruins, but the Baroque ruins are very much a pain in the butt. Like, they just don't benefit us, really. Like, this is just not fun. For real, like, um, I'm gonna encounter a lot of stuff that I can't do anything about. Like, I, I, I don't have the ability to take on. And, um, you know, like, I don't know what level you really should be to take on the Baroque Ruins. I'm not sure what what the requirements are like the baroque ruins like fighting a gam gam is tough and i'm not saying we couldn't if i had all my skills um maybe that really is where where the the no skills is really kind of holding us back um but just in general the baroque ruins kind of suck we don't really get we don't get any experience from killing traipsing mortars that's wild to me We're at, we're at a hundred and, oh no, we're at one million experience points, by the way. I've acquired one million experience points in this run. Spring turret grenade, yay. <laughs> Love that for me. Love that we are getting a spring turret grenade. That I know what that is now. Okay, this is a really strange array of, of underground. We're just doing, we're doing, we're playing by the numbers here. We're going through it step by step. We're trying to find, oh, there's a legendary uh, goat folk there. We've been very lucky with the uh, goat folk, I must say. Let's check out this goat folk. What kind of rep do you have? Disliked by oozes. Oh, whatever. <laughs> they, they already hate us. Give you some reputation. Or some secrets. Hey, you know what would be fun? Why don't you share me a secret? Um, Shares the location of Steel Shamur. That's a ruin. Uh, a goat folk village. No surprise there. Nothing really exciting to report on that one. Livid Creepers no longer give us anything. I don't know. I, I really don't know what I'm, I'm looking for anymore. <laughs> I don't know what I'm trying to find. I don't know what I want. Something... We just, like, want stuff of high value. You know, crystal goods would be nice. Um... Uh, if I could get lucky enough to find a time cube, that'd be kind of cool. But, uh, very unlikely. Okay, no hostiles. 
Apparently we're on good terms with ants. <gasps> Wait a minute. That was a clone link. Hmm. Do I try and take advantage of the situation? I don't think so. But hey, that was promising. If we could um if we could find like a clone link, get cloned twice. Mm, if there were I guess we would need more than one clone link on the board. We'd need two clone link on the board, so that would mean that Assuming that they've both used Temporal Fugue, that means they've created 18 of us. That would mean that we could... Ass assuming we escape from them, drink our Cloneling Draughts, create 13... I think it would work. We could do it. We need, we need 18 of us on the board. So we need two... Um, Clonelings visible. Tall order, for sure. Clonelings are not exactly common. But I guess I'm I, I am sorry, I, I I was zooming past there, I did not see that there was a cloneling that we got uh cloned. Okay. We are still making our way downtown. We're at strata eleven. Doing all right. Things are fine. Nothing, nothing spicy. Still don't like fighting, um, saw handers. We're at AV is 17. I just realized it's not, a, not, it's not great. I feel like I want to be at like minimum AV 20. Why are, why is our AV down so much? We have an extra face. Why is our extra face unequipped? Okay, our... Oh, our Astronus is uh, broken. That's why. I wonder how long that's been like that. Fix it spray foam on our Astronus. Also, our um, nuclear cell on it is drained. I can't remember what the Astronus even does. You can see through... Oh, right. This thing is great. I love this thing. Uh, do we have anything we can shove in this thing? I guess just a, another nuclear cell. Kessel face is still worth it. Worn on back nylon body pack. There is a reason I didn't want to wear this thing anymore. And that was because seeing creatures through walls is actually kind of a pain. You're drying out. Oh, we're out of water. Oh, that's no good. Uh, God. All right, so I guess we're going somewhere. We're done here. Could go back to Great Gate. Go ahead and recharge the solar cell. Um, so we can go back to the Icker Merchant. I don't know. I don't think enough time has passed for the Icker Merchant to be viable. But either way, I have to uh, sell some stuff. He still has stuff that we've sold them like ages and ages ago. Sell a wrist fan. Um, structural scanning bracelet. I don't think I'll ever need that. Sell some chem cells. Okay, we're good. All right. Sometimes the loading screens in could get to be a lot. I'm not sure why they uh, add up. It seems like they add up over time. You're too famished, okay. Um, all right, where are we going? We're going to Icker Merchant. Probably they're, they, they haven't 
you know, change their wares at all. We could go back down to the ruin. We're still hoping for a cloneling at some point. Have you changed your wares? Nope. Doesn't doesn't look like it. I don't think they have. Brain Brian. Um Hired Guard. What we could do is we could save scum a little bit. Let's um what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take off my fist of the ape god. See what happens if I attack this guard. Okay. So that didn't that wasn't good. Our our strength is high enough that we are able to kill we're able, I guess our fist is still 15 penetration. So even at 1d2 minus one, it still has the potential to crit like insanely. Do we have any lava on us that we can drink? Uh, we need a, we need a quick death right now. Um, Okay, well, let, let's leave. Don't worry, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna mess this up. I'm gonna leave. It's saving the game. I don't want it to, I guess it, saving the game is not the same as setting down a checkpoint. We're gonna go to the rust wells. Oh, did I sell my, I think I did, didn't I? I'm, I'm, I, my my flight is it an armor oh god i think i did i wonder if i jumped if it would be oh you know what we could go to golgotha there we go uh what i want to do is fall from a very high distance no i don't want to investigate a layer i'm pretty sure you have to fly but this this could work as well Oh, we can't do this either. Damn it. <laughs> I, I sold my ability to fly. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> um, I need to die right now. Okay. Uh, ignite. Detonate. I'm gonna detonate sower seeds until we die. I, I'm sure there's a death we could, we could get an achievement from right now. Let me see real quick. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Nope. Uh, wink out of existence. <laughs> Open your mind, have your head explode. I mean, that would be nice if we could like make that happen, but that's that's not going to happen. Uh, what are some of like the hidden? Are there hidden achievements? Hidden ways to die? Let me see. Just checking. I'm not really. I, I I don't think that there is. I I. Damn it. Oh, get killed by a kraken. But like, I need to find a kraken. We could go and find a kraken real quick. Krakens are unfortunately kind of rare. <laughs> um, kill a chrome pyramid. Open your brain. Uh, rock hazing ritual that would require getting killed by baboons. Free falling. So free falling, I wonder, let me see. Let me have a quick look here. Free falling. Die by falling down a shaft. The problem is, is that the shaft is currently like fine like it, it's it's an elevator i can't go up or down it um hmm. we could find a shaft down here somewhere actually going to golgotha to to try and 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 find a way to die is is truly some caves of cud right now not finding any shafts that are, are appropriate. 
Did we kill the slog? Can't remember if we killed the slog. Feel like I did kill the slog. I think I did because I got the slog anunculus. Okay, um, I don't really want to recoil out because if I do that, then I'll accidentally save the game and I'm, I'm not in a good position right now for a, 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 a game save. Spiral bore? <laughs> this is so stupid. This is so dumb. Um, plasma grenade? Okay, plasma grenade. And... Um... Poison gas grenade. I, I, like, to kill myself is actually very difficult. Oh, I guess we could just make some high explosive grenades. Let's just do that. We actually don't have a lot of scrap right now. We'll make some thermal grenades. Okay, and now I'm gonna go ahead and coat myself in plasma. Coated in plasma. And then we're gonna d detonate some thermal grenades. Honestly, just like two of these should do it. We're at... 5,600 degrees, 8,400 degrees. I guess we can we can get pretty hot. We can get pretty toasty before we before death. 11,000 degrees. There you go. You were vaporized. Low reload from checkpoint. I'll be very upset if our checkpoint was before I decided to accidentally kill a cloneling. Um, you know, it, it occurred to me. Okay, we could try this one more time. Is instead of attacking... Instead of attacking the cloneling directly, why don't we just kill one of the friends? You're too famished. Like, they're all in the same legion. What We could attack one of, ironically, one of the uh, Icar merchants. We could attack one of them, and then the cloneling will... will aggro to us and then um likely make a clone of us this seems like a good idea okay let's let's do this all right so killing an icker merchant that's fine we're gonna take another hit to our reputation i feel like the cloneling has made a clone of something else okay there's a there's a clone of us so we just need uh one more clone and then maybe maybe it'll work out i don't know i think the clone ling has run out of juice Waiting for the cloneling to do anything. Okay, they've made another me. I think. Okay, okay. This is going well. Um, so now I'm going to start drinking clone juice. Drink. Unsettling um, ambivalent. And I'm just going to drink hold on let's make this a bit easier on us drink no 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 i didn't want to do that budding okay this is a uh, surprisingly time consuming drink i'm trying not to kill anything drink 
detaches from you. It might be that I, I didn't have to wait so long to do this because all of my clones are likely going to make temporal clones for me. So I will only have to do this a couple of times. Let's see if I can do it now. It doesn't look like it. So are we we're not budding right now? Detaches from me. So here's the problem. All right. Yeah, there, there's a there's a major problem here. Okay, let's try this one more time. I know I know this is becoming insane. Um, I need an easy way to kill myself. I, you know what? Let's go to the. Um, oh, that's not an easy way to kill myself at all. I need. Uh, can we can we drink acid or something? I don't know. Just just damn. I don't know. This is okay. Oh yeah, neutron flux. There we go. Oh, I guess dropping it isn't enough. Get. Uh, we have to throw it. I, I can't believe what is happening right now. This is so stupid. <laughs> um, equip. Thrown weapon. I guess we can restore our checkpoint. We don't have to kill ourselves. There we go. Here's. So, okay. Here's what we're going to do. It's very simple. Um, what we have to do is find something that will not die in one hit we could we could do it at the the icker merchant but i don't think that that's really good um we need to find something that is that will not die in one hit uh that we can attack and what we're going to do is fill that screen with as many clones as we can are able to and then aggro that thing in question right um so that basically all of our clones, they'll they'll pop their temporal clones. They'll they'll pop their temporal fugue, and that will make it so that they are can, can we actually get our head blown up right now? That would actually do me never mind. Never mind. You you you're just pathetic. Never mind. Too famished, okay. Now we could actually I could consider doing uh chrome pyramid. <laughs> kind of uh, hilarious I, at least we know that the chrome pyramid will not die right away you know so why don't we consider that it's an easy way of doing it we can always like tr like if it doesn't work the worst thing that happens is I die so we either succeed or we f or we fail there's no in between the worst part is if we fail in a way that you know ruins this world even more than it is We're leaving. No, I don't want to go check out some ruins right now. I want to go to the six day stilt. And we're going to fill fill this um, space with clones of ourselves. Okay, this could be the moment. This could be the last episode. Tell you what. Uh, well, no, we won't use bra Brain Brine because I actually... Having less abilities is actually very beneficial to me right now. So, drink. Something is angry with us right now. Okay, we're, we're fine now. All right, um, continue drinking cloning draughts. Drink. Okay, so what I want to do is actually make a checkpoint right now. Because there's no real going back from this. Bizarre to me that these clones, like, technically count as friends. Saving checkpoint. Okay, we're going back.
<laughs> it's, it's taking so long to make a checkpoint right now. Okay. Gather up my friends, my brethren. We are going to do the impossible. All right. Um, attack. Never, never mind. <laughs> okay, maybe this isn't the right way to go about this. Um. Hmm. We could just attack literally anything. We're, we're on okay terms still. Okay, we're not. All right, there we go. Come on, friends. Fugue. Fugue. I, I could make enemies to my own clones, maybe. Are we we're, we're on good terms still? Let's just attack everything. Fugue, my friends. Do it for great justice. It's not happening. Okay. Hmm. Oh, things are actually killing my friends. This guy disarmed my fist of the ape god. Okay, this is this is not working. I want to restore the checkpoint. I'm going to we have a we have a button here now. Now that I know it. Remove. We are going to throw our neutron flux down. Okay. So that didn't quite work. I'm not sure why not. Um, I could try and direct all of our clonelings. I don't know if it's possible to just tell them the fugue. Uh, direct to attack target. Engage defensively. Direct ability use. Uh, wow. You get to have a Kimbo, but I don't. Um, directing... <sighs> Directing them to use certain abilities. Great idea. Except for the fact that they have all of the skills that I don't for some reason. And so it's just kind of a pain. I'd rather just kind of like hope I get lucky. And they just all temporal fugue. What we could do is we could try and I, I don't know like is is uh do you think that neutron flux is enough to take out a uh <laughs> to take out a, a chrome pyramid kind of like it got rid of the force field see it, it instantly kills me Uh, let's just like keep trying. Hold on. Temple Fugue, is this enough? This looks like a lot of clones. Still not enough clones, huh? Absolute chaos right now. Just what is exactly happening in the in the home of Denver? What is hap what is this chaos? I'll tell you what this chaos is, is it's not productive. Cause despite all of the clones that are currently on the screen, it's not counting towards the achievement.
Um, hmm. I just feel like I'm not getting lucky. Like I have, an, I have enough clones right now that if I they even like four of them used temporal fugue, that would be enough, right? Even three of them, because if three of them did it, then that would make for ten each. I'm pretty sure even two of them using it would be enough. So I don't know what's what the deal is. Okay, here's my new theory. The reason that they're not temporal fuging is because they can't. Because maybe there's just too much stuff in the way. So what I'm going to do is direct to stay here. What we're going to do is try and space them out a little bit. Hello and welcome back to Caves of Cud. Um, let me see what we got left here. We've got some get killed and some various difficult tasks. Um, and we also have to, let's see if we can't find a clone link. That wouldn't be a bad thing. If we could find a clone link, um, then we could maybe try and get 30 clones of ourselves. The only place I know of that like is guaranteed to have a cloneling is the is Bethesda Susa, but I'm pretty sure I killed all of them. Okay, we have a, a legendary arachnid here. Dislike by trolls. It'd be nice to get back on uh, back on good terms with trolls. Sure, let's uh let's take out this guy. Oh, there's a uh, space-time vortex. Jesus. Okay. It's going to be like that, is it? Where'd they go? There. Hmm. Why are we not using our fist? Okay, we are using the fist, but we're not penetrating this thing, really? Okay. That was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Glow whites are now, like, favored. We're back to zero with trolls. Cragmanch, not cool with us. That's fine. So, um, the game actually crashed. We're still corrupt humanoid. That's a real problem. I feel like that's one of the reasons we're not getting the achievement right now.
Yeah. I I think we're hosed. I, I think that um the 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 bug has ceased prevented us from uh, achieving our goal. Achieving our goal. So that sucks. I, I think so. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm not um, interpreting this achievement correctly. Either way, uh, I tried my best, and I'm I'm ready to call it quits on this character and on this this run. Like it's it's gotten to be kind of ridiculous. It's not working properly. I need to reassess which mods I want to have uh, loaded. Some of them are failing. Um, some of them have no longer they're no longer being maintained. So I think I'm going to close this character out, um, finally, by drinking seven more drams of brain brine. What a way to go. Um, sucks. That really, that really is a bummer. But especially because that, that was like one of the hardest achievements to, to get on this character, or at least one of the more grindy ones. So now I have to try and do that again. Ugh. Okay. So here we go. You have you gain 489 skill points. That that is actually very helpful. Actually, really appreciate the skill points there. We're at 15. You uh, gained the ability a life drain. Drink. Every time I drink a dram of brain brine, drink sense psychic. One of the most useless abilities in the entire game. Drink. Three to go. Shake the water. Psychometry. Psychometry is quite nice, but uh, yeah, we're like we're kind of good here. If I got domination, that's the only thing I would consider continuing this run for. Um, your willpower increase. That's kind of nice. Because you can actually dominate, um, you can dominate the creatures in the Tomb of the Eaters to give you back the repulsive device. It's not a nice thing to do, but it's something you can do. We got more skill points. Nice. Well, I mean, I could continue make you know, inventing, um, some recipes, but we can always do that on, an, on a new run. So, so that's the final achievement for this run acquired, the Cycle Chorus. Learn the skill Flattening Fire. Deft blocking. What the heck is flattening fire? I like how we still have a Kimbo toggle down, even though we don't have the skill anymore. Flattening fire. What is that? Life drain. We have two life drains. Uh. Temporal fugue. Where is flattening fire? Um, let's drink our last brain brine. We don't have to, but, you know, it's fun. And our final power is... Nothing. It's a film here. Uh, nothing. We, we got nothing for that. <laughs> Amazing. Our psychic glimmer is at 25. Our ego is down to 22 now. Um, Yeah. Nice. Well, let's buy another mutation point. Uh, mutation just for fun. Horns, force bubble. Sure, why not? Get our get our psychic glimmer back up to thirty. There we go. All right. Well, I think that is going to do it. Oh, there we go. Willpower three. We got three more willpower. We got a lot of willpower now. It's gonna do it for this character. Um. There's not really anything else I could do. I could try and get a couple of death achievements, but I can always do that in future runs. Um, and besides that, I mean, it's there's a, there's a lot of luck based stuff that I have to do. Make friends with um, crabs. Try and I, I guess I have to you know get get ourselves some neutron flux and also fifty thousand drams to do that. I guess that's the last thing I could do on this character is I could try and make up. 50,000 drams. You know what I could do? It's just occurred to me. Hmm. Are we done? Give me, give me one second here. Let me consider something. What do you have, sir? You got some rough gemstone, some, some stuff. Okay, you, you're dead now. 
Yes, we are going full dark mode, aren't we? Give me all your stuff. Oh, never mind. The Chrome Pyramid is now angry with me. Mistakes were made. Your companion died. They're dying to a Chrome Pyramid currently. I can't believe I survived, actually. This is a long episode, but it is a... It is, uh, in many ways, the finale to the series. The finale. The finale to what? Vast Animus, huh? Get out of here, dude. So, uh, you may you may have guessed what I'm going to do. Wait, what, what do you mean? Oh, are my companions are still dying to Chrome Pyramids. Hey, permanent ego boost. Nice, thank you. I'm so sick of dragonflies preventing me from flying away. Okay. Uh, I'm, I'm going to destroy everything. Absolutely everything. I'm going to kill our Iker merchants. I'm going to collect their goods. All of the goods that I had uh, previously sold to them. Uh, in many ways, we have a ton of stuff here available to us. Um, you're famished. And I think with all of that, maybe we would have uh, 50,000 rams. Unfortunately, carrying it all is not really going to be feasible, but we're going to try it anyway. That's fine. We're going to take a hit to our uh, reputation. Why are we getting hurt so badly? I guess they, uh, they had Neutron Flux, didn't they? Yeah, they did. And that has destroyed everything, hasn't it? Look at that, a cloning draught. Bloody file. They, they destroyed everything. I can't believe it. Okay, well, that's gonna do it. I, I, I don't, I don't want to have to contend with that. I forgot the fact that they were gonna have Neutron Flux on them. That's just that's just the biggest absolute kick in the in the um, just like wow <laughs> wow I mean I could die I could throw you know let's uh, equip this we I've been I, it's been it's been a rough couple of episodes <laughs> it really has um you know what you know what I should do um instead of trying to to kill a bunch of characters oh no we're in the dark universe now we're in the chrome pyramid universe because i left the six day still right makes sense um here's what we're gonna do first of all i'm gonna go to the Iker merchants we're, we're gonna do this properly um i'm going to buy their neutron flux from them so they don't have the neutron flux right makes sense right okay buy this uh you know we're gonna sell the books because we need to get rid of as much weight as possible right now data disk spiral bar uh chem cells this is so stupid <laughs> this has been the dumbest couple of episodes okay there done you don't have neutron flux great love it um do you have neutron flux they're all gonna have neutron flux is the first part okay you don't actually thank the good lord you do not have neutron flux do you have neutron flux you do have neutron flux okay well all right let's go through it dude let's let's uh what what's it gonna take for you to not want to have that anymore <laughs> um we still have our Jaspers. That's nice. Uh, I'm regretting selling that last dram of, of brain brine. I'll, I'll say that for nothing. We could sell like... Wow, there's really nothing. Like I have e Eater's Nectar Injector is not worth that much. We could sell military cards, I guess. We could sell all of these cards. Why not? Wow, Cybernetics Credit Wedge is only worth 24. That's kind of absurd. 
We could start selling herb berries, but like, come on. I'm desperate, but I'm not that desperate. Okay, now let's just hope that the last one does not have uh, neutron flux, because I'm pretty sure he cannot afford it. Oh my god, he does. We have metamorphic polygel, by the way, so I could potentially duplicate something of high value. I wonder how much our weapon is worth. Let's sell some of these extra recoilers. Like I say, this is the end. There's no going back from this. Uh, sell Grit Gate recoiler, sure. Ezra recoiler. Uh, actually, I'll keep the Ezra recoiler because we could go to Ezra and maybe continue the dark run, to put it lightly. Sell all of this stuff. I, it doesn't matter because I'm about to get it back. Minstrel token, sure. Herberries. Okay, all right. We'll have to pony up. That's fine. Okay, now they don't have any uh, neutron flux. Now we can safely kill them. Did he drink the sun slag? Okay. So now we need to pick and choose the stuff that is going to be the most valuable. Whoops. Including nuclear cells. Those are going to be valuable. Not uh, <laughs> rusted ones, of course. Uh, we'll take floating glow spheres. Mm, those are not really worth that much. Okay, none of this stuff. We'll take the brain brine. That is worth something. Okay, file of cloning draw. Well, we, we got we got lucky on that, I guess. Herberries, minstrel token. Um. Hoping that we got get our actual stuff back. I'm not really seeing much of it. Maybe it's because I've already picked it up. I guess we are picking up quite a lot of stuff right now. It's kind of making things confusing, if I'll be honest. Okay, so there's some sun slag and brain brine. That's going to give us some money. I was thinking um, if, if this doesn't work out... Then I could try and I could try and uh, fight the uh, the O clam because uh, you know I haven't really considered that as an option, and it's not really it, they're they're pretty uh, likened to like a chrome pyramid in terms of difficulty, but we could we could give it a go. Okay, so now uh, I want to go to Ezra. We're carrying a lot of stuff right now, including many drams of Neutron Flux. I wonder if that's worth, like, a lot to them. Um, I don't know what I'm looking for right now. I want to... We have a lot of files that I need to drop. That will save us a lot of room. We're going to Ezra. Uh, replace cell with any other cell activate. We could also tinker up quite a few things that would be valuable. Maybe some grenades. Okay, so I'm sorry to those who are fans of uh, Ezra. I, I I know you you're not gonna like me for this, and I don't blame you. Uh, this is not a good run. This is you know a very spiteful run. Flawless Christine will grab that. We're gonna be over encumbered, but that's fine. We're gonna drop some stuff. Okay. Um, we want to drop a few things. We've got tons and tons of stuff right now, and not all of it is valuable. We're definitely going to drop a ton of files. Drop some canteens. We're actually okay now. We're, we're, we're pretty okay now. Um, we're not on good terms with certain people, for sure. Um, wonder if Ela has something that we could sell. 
Have we sold anything to you? Would they have some implants? Missile launcher, recoiler, weird artifact. Sure. So again, I'm sorry. Yeah, my reputation is tanking. I and I, I deserve this. Uh, crystal boots are gonna be way too heavy, maybe. So we'll take the data discs. Quartz fur hat. I wonder if that's worth. Well, it's, it couldn't be worth more than crystal boots, I think. So now I have. To, I'm gonna have to drop some more stuff. Can we? Is there? What can? Well, we can drop some of this. These water skins. Like you know, the cure for um. What you call it? Glot rot is no longer really you know, valuable to us anymore. Did I get rid of my Eid Freehold recoiler? No, I didn't. I was smart enough to keep that. So let's go there. So now I'm going to try with all of this stuff to buy the other pearl and that will really do it. There's not, there's not a dang other thing that I could possibly do in this run. And uh, good, because this character deserves death. They are 100% a villain. Okay. Um, so we need to get lost. We're getting lost. And now we need to find a clam. We're not on good terms with this Fardim anymore. What did we pick up? Oh, we butchered Svardim, uh, the Svardim. We we need to turn Butcher off. Where is that? Where is Butcher? Yo, where is it though? Oh, skills, right. Butcher, where are you? Too many skills. Okay. Now I need to drop some food. I just need to, I need to get to this clam and then we're, we're good. We're good to go. All right. Find ourselves a clam. Just need to find a clam. We're lost right now. Yes, correct. We're lost. I, I have a horrible feeling I'm going to get there and I'm going to find out I don't have enough water. I don't want to regain my bearings. <laughs> This place is such a pain in the butt to get to. Hostels nearby. Yeah, there sure are. Okay. They have crystal goods. Honestly, killing Svardim is probably one of the best ways of making money. Oh, there was a temporal space-time vortex. Okay, well, we're, now we're down here. 19 strata deep underground. What an absolute mess. We've we've done so well to make, you know, friends with with certain people and now I like I've completely thrown it away. Okay, we have to go back to Eid Freehold and then get lost again. You know, the problem is is that there's a finite number of times I can do this. I can't actually make like I can't get lost forever because you will automatically regain your bearings by entering a zone that you've previously already entered. So... Notice some ruins? No. Okay, we need to get lost. Police! Police let us get lost! No. I don't want to go to a lair. No! I don't want that. I don't want to get lost. Uh. Oh God, I'm I'm not feeling great about this. Please let we've we've done so much to try and and you know do this properly. I guess we could get lost in the Palladium. Uh, there's also potentials for clams there. Oh oh. Here we go. You lost. Good. 
I need I need a clam. I'm not seeing one. I'm not seeing a clam. There isn't one. Do not regain your bearings. Okay. I need a clam, please. Please. I wonder if you can pick up a clam. This, that would be ideal. Is if you could pick up a clam. You recognize the area. Okay, well, there it is. <sighs> Guys, I, I think it's a dead loss. I, I think I've uh, lost my, ironically, uh, lost my opportunity to uh, get to the, the extra dimension and buy the other pearl. I don't think that there's a, a way I can really do it. Because, you know, every time I did a clam jump, I basically loaded a zone, right? And so there aren't many spots. There aren't going to be a lot of spots left that I haven't seen at some point, right? And so getting lost is, is just not viable. Uh, okay. All right, let's, let's try the Palladium Reef. I haven't been in the Palladium Reef as much, I think. Here we go, here we go. Yes. Uh, not seeing a clam. This would be the perfect zone for a clam, too. Okay, please, please do not regain. Do not re Oh, damn it. There's a clam here, too. Oh, my God. Uh, I just needed you to not regain your bearings and we would have been home free. All right, well, there's a star crack, and you know what? Perfect. That's perfect. You know what we're going to do is we're going to die to a gam gam. Nothing is going right right now. Absolutely nothing is going right. Yep, we died. I was going to I was gonna go walk over and die to a star crack, and instead we're going to die to a gam gam. There's nothing for us there. There's no reward for doing that. So literally nothing is going well right now. I guess we loaded, so that means we have the potential to get lost, more likely. But this this has been this is being frustrating right now, I will say. I, I cannot believe what is happening right now. Okay, you're lost. The criteria to enter this place is uh, you know. I've, I've talked about it before. It's it kind of a um, contradictory. <gasps> Clam! Yes! 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 Okay, okay, buddy. You will, you would not believe the lengths I've gone to, to, to get here, to buy this it's 60,000 now. What do you mean it's 60,000? Was it always 60,000? Okay, we're, we're just, we're selling every, actually, I won't sell the metamorphic polygel. I'm going to see what costs the absolute most and we're going to duplicate it. Uh, d -d 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 I really don't have all that much stuff going on. Okay, the rifle of the logical lake is sixteen hundred. We could duplicate that twice. Wet jeweled encrusted geomagnet. Okay, that that can definitely be cloned. I think that that is the best I'm going to do. So let's do that. So we're gonna go ahead and get our applicator and apply this to our geomagnetic disc. If I so if I can't afford to buy it i am going to uh, attempt to fight them and it's just occurred to me i could sell my equipment as well i don't think i'm going to do better than the geomagnetic disc though and we'll apply another one to the geomagnetic disc All right, and let's unequip everything. 
This is it, y'all. I'm also going to tinker up some grenades just to get, you know, sell literally everything. Quantum moat. It's, it's, we can't even see right now. Not sure why. I, I noticed in the top right corner we have uh, very fun things happening. Um, okay, so. Uh, yeah, I was going to tinker up some grenades. All right, here we go. Uh, uh, uh. All right, we're going to tinker up uh, as many freeze grenade Mark 3s as I can. All right. All right, here we go. Wow, uh, that, that might actually take a second. Let's trade, buddy. Here we go. What do you mean? It's 120,000. Why does it keep doubling in price? Why does it keep doubling in price? It's doubled in price like twice now. Let me have a look at this. Raises glimmer. Uh, causes extra dimensional items to be generated significantly more. Adds five to a factor, which multiplies the probability of items being extra dimensional. You can duplicate it. So I'm just going to see what, how much I get for giving him. I, I don't, I, I don't think I have 120,000 drams. That's that much is certain to me, but I, I'm, I'm just going to see how much I have. Okay. Uh, I didn't even get the 50,000. Okay, well, there's nothing left to do than to try and fight him. Okay, I don't know what happened to my uh, Kessler face. Been, it's been a somewhat of a stressful run, I gotta say. Let's just drop all these grenades. Okay, we're good now. Uh, and then we're gonna fight him. Oh. Alright, that's interesting. Just, just fight them. I'm not sure what is about to occur exactly. They they offset the entire world. <laughs> Opens wide and the knacker inside its shell glimmers with unseen light. You sense psychic presences foreign to this place and time. They are they are currently fine. <laughs> Merely clicks. Things are gonna get um, pretty pretty nasty very soon. This is this is kind of why I didn't want to do this because I didn't think it was gonna be very viable. I I do want to throw some neutron flux at them. Let's do that. Oh well, I got hit by it myself. All right, you know what? That's gonna do it. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, this is an absurd amount of money. I'm not sure how you're supposed to buy the other pearl. Maybe you're just supposed to try and fight them. But either way, I'm not going to do it this run. We'll, we'll save it for another run. Uh, if you enjoyed the series and it's uh, kind of limp-legged uh, <laughs> finale, then I really appreciate it if you want to hit that like button and consider subscribing. And uh, I'll see you for the next character as I continue to try and get every achievement in Caves of Cud. Thank you very much for the sub uh, to the subscribers of my coffee and for supporting the channel. I really appreciate y'all. And I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye.